All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. Thanks for joining me. So we got another exciting product we're going to be taking a look at today. A lot of you might remember, or at least some of you, one of the very first really popular products I had looked at on this channel was the MVP3 by Anakin. And today we're going full circle and taking a look at the newest MVP, the five and these things are like star wars movies they only come out every couple of years so it's always a big deal so hang tight guys you definitely ain't gonna want to go nowhere it is the mvp5 today on indoor smokers <laughs> so that's right guys the MVP5 has arrived. I just had somebody ask me about this a couple of days ago. All right, guys, check it out. Purple and gold, just like my Washington Huskies. Or I guess LSU for those of you down in that part of the country. But either way you look at it, she is a thing of oh, beauty. Check it out. Now, Anakin did send me a bunch of other stuff, including a couple of other colored MVPs. So we have a black and red, it looks like, and then sort of a gray and silver. And if you guys are interested in some sneak peeks, we got a Anakin Go Max tube that we'll be looking at later in the month. We got that in several different colors. We also got a slide tube, t-shirts, hats. All kind of stuff, almost an entire bait mail in that package right there. So thank you so much, Anakin, for the brand new MVP5. So we do have the Ajax tank on here, and that is a 5 mil tank. It does come in a 2 mil option for those of you across the pond there. And then you do have a bottom adjustable airflow top fill and it slides open very nice bam and we got a 0.16 plex matrix 3d coil going on in there so that sounds pretty freaking awesome and it is actually recommended vaping range is 50 to 80 watts so a nice range on that so what we got going on here is a 55 that's right five five zero zero ma built-in battery with a sealed micro usb i think it is actually a c type it is dust proof water resistant all of that type of stuff you've got everything covered down below here you actually have your outward going electricity because this thing in staying true to the mvps and what they were known for since the mvp3 that you can actually charge your cell phones or other things off of this device as well and then there's also something else a special secret about this mvp5 going on that none of the other mvps had so check this out what maybe it'll be easier for you to see this way what I have not been drinking this evening, officer. Damn, dude, not only does it have a built-in flashlight, but it's got a freaking bright flashlight. Let's see if you can notice a difference in here. Hell yeah. So the screen itself, you have your power button right here. If you press your power button three times, that will turn the unit off. Look at that, that's pretty cool. Three, she comes back to life again. All right, if you press that, action button three times that's going to take you into all your different menu options here so in wattage mode you have normal soft and boost and then you also have curve that you can do if you want to set your custom curves on that you have your tc modes 100 to 315 celsius 2 to 600 fahrenheit you also have your cutoff option which you can actually set up to whatever i've got to set it 10 seconds but you can go ahead and you can actually set that up to 18 seconds if you want your puff counter you can reset that there if you want to get in here and mess with your colors and there you go so whatever color you want to work with on the screen i kind of like that green and you can also adjust the brightness and the amount of time that you want the screen to stay on after you're done vaping sensors which I don't quite get. You also have the system and you can do a bunch of different stuff in here. So to adjust the wattage, you're gonna press the up or down button, hold it until it starts blinking. 
And then you can scroll through in 0.5 increments, which is awesome. I don't like to wait around for those 0.1s. And it is going to allow you to do all the way up to 120 watts. Bam! All right, guys, just scraping up the last of last month's sample box. I believe Kelly told me that we do have the October sample box. She just hasn't brought it up yet. But we're going to go ahead and check out this milkshake man and this is a delicious strawberry milkshake with whipped cream on top but i'm kind of in the mood for a sweet desserty flavor tonight so strawberry milkshake sounds pretty good pretty 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 good larry david fans out there and if you guys can see here it is actually reading this coil oh look at that we got time going on and that is the correct time it is freaking late at night that i'm filming this for you guys hopefully you're not watching it this late but that needs to say a.m instead of p.m but anyways if you can see down here it is reading that coil at exactly 0.16 it rarely actually hits spot on like that but all right here we go guys 60 watt vape on the brand new mvp5 Woo! Damn, that is good, man. That milkshake, man. Strawberry milkshake. You really actually can taste not only the strawberry milkshake, but I'm getting some of that fucking Cool Whip dessert topping as well. Really nice drag on this. It's not a super airy vape, not super restrictive. It's just a nice really medium I would say resistant airflow on this thing and I do have it wide open right now let's try 70 since it can go all the way up to 80 there we go all right here we go 70 watt Woo! holy cockamole man damn that is a nice vape this is probably the best big boy vape I've seen Anakin put out in a while. And I gotta say, these Plex 3D Matrix mesh coils are freaking worth all of the words you gotta say to name the goddamn things. I'm gonna do it at 80, just see how quick of a vape we can get off of this thing. Hell yeah, two second vapes. So, all right guys, as you can see, she vapes awesome. I did forget to see what we have in our accessory case here. So let's see, damn, thick ass book. Oh, a couple of replacement seals, gaskets. Oh yeah, and then there you go with your funky ass cord. I guess that's the type C plug. Yeah, funky ass cord. Hells yeah, Anakin definitely knocked this one out the freaking park worthy of that MVP name and that couple of year delay on getting a brand new one. Can't forget about that either, guys. Whoops, sorry about that. Are you seeing spots? Well, all right, guys, this is the only vape on the market bright enough to blind someone and heavy enough to crack them over the head once you have. Actually strong enough to take a beating as well or give one. All right, guys, if you want to check out the new MVP5, I'm going to put that link right underneath this video where you can do so. If you want to check out a sample box subscription, the E-Juice of the Month Club, I survive almost solely off my sample box a lot of months. I will put a link underneath the video where you can do that as well. I know I'm wrapping up. I just can't quit hitting on this thing. It's like your girlfriend's hot roommate or something. Alright guys, otherwise, regular routine, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already, ring that little bell so you get the notifications. If you like this video today, or you are enthralled with this brand new MVP5, I'm about to have a vapor lance coming down on me, make sure you give us a thumbs up, they are greatly appreciated. And as always, don't forget to just have yourself a great vaping day, I'll catch you right back here, Tamari, peace out vape fam.